Hello everybody, it's me, <clears throat> Scott Milliam, and we're back with the final episode of Let's Play 102 Dalmatians. Uh, for the final episode, I decided I wanted to run through all of the mini games that we have acquired for the entire game. But first off, let's look at the stickers that we have got. And we got every single one of them. That is awesome. That is actually the first time ever that I've gotten every single sticker in my life. That is a good life achievement, I must say. It feels good to finally have done this. Just want to look at the different stickies. Oh, there we go. So that's the stickers. Now all we have to do is look at the mini games. First off, we have mini golf. It's pretty simple. It's just mini golf, but it's like very cool stages. Shit, and you can play with with your friends as well. And of course, you want to try to get hole in one. Uh, didn't get hold of one there, but I was close. And they're all like themed after the different random things. Like for example, here you have the Eiffel Tower. There's the countryside level that we played. Ah, oh, damn it! Didn't put it hard enough. There you go. Yeah, here's the Stonehenge. And let's just try putting it right in there. Well, I don't think I'm going to show every single one of these because they it's going to take a long time. So this is basically mini golf. Just play mini golf. Uh, after that we have uh, that. There we go. We have dig dog. We are a dog and you dig. And we're going to be one player. So what you do here is you dig, and you try to match up different things, and it's basically memory, that's all it is. So that's not very special. Uh, the next thing we have is Tilt Maze, you've probably seen this before, like the Tilt Maze, it's... Uh, it's I actually remember we had this in like kindergarten and people were like all the kids were always fighting about who wanted to play with this. It's a fun little thing. Trying to get it to go through without having it falling into one of the holes. Like it did just there. And that's basically what it is. It's just you go through and you have like three or four levels. I don't remember actually. It's a long time since I played it so bear that in mind. After that, we have checkers, which is probably one of my favorite mini games in this game. And the only thing is that you move around as move around as domino, and you like, yeah, I can't really explain. It's like you just choose what piece you want to move, and and then you go. And you try to capture every single one of the opponents. That's how checkers work. After that, we have probably the best uh, mini game, which is the ice race. I'm actually going to show the entire thing here because this is actually a very fun thing. So you can choose between Priscilla, which is slow. If I, no, wait, uh, she is uh, fast, but she doesn't really jump that high. Chester, I, okay, I can't play as Chester or Crystal, but Chester is medium in everything, both jumping and running, and he can enter through holes. 
Crystal is not that fast, but she jumps high. So first off, we just want to get use Priscilla. It's not that difficult. I'm gonna try and get every single one of them. As you can see, you can jump, and if you pick up one of the clocks, uh, it will disable the toys for a little while. And it's really easy. It's a lot of fun, but it's easy. It's just all hell. And you get so many different speed ups, like all this speed. Also, up to that ledge there, you had to be Crystal to get up there, obviously, because she can jump higher. And you see the holes on the sides all the time. Those are for um, the mouse, Chester. And there's really not that much to count it, but it's just a race. It's still the funniest thing, or well, the funniest thing to actually play in this game. Like, other than the game itself, of course. Uh, see if you can make it in uh, less time than the record. Coming up on the end pretty soon here. And there it is. I did it in record time. I don't really care for these, and I just gotta. I gotta call myself something at least once in the game. I can't call myself Scar, can I? Nope. No. Oh, Scar then. I don't know why I would save. Well, I guess. There's no point in putting in the name if I didn't save. Now let's play as Chester. He's my favorite. He's not that fast, though, as you will see. But. As I just said, you can enter the holes and earn yourself a lot of time. And I love the sound it makes. Oh wait, it's not a hole. As you can see, I'm already pretty far up. Go through here. Right. There's a hole right up there. I'm just going to the side here and get the the holy here. Holy moly. Didn't really take me that far. To be somewhere at least. It better be one here because this is like a long Really long stretch. Or I can just use the speed boosts. There's the hole. And into this one, -ish, that should put us at the end. There we go. Now let's go as Crystal. She is not fast. At all. She is slow. I mean, for rabbits, she is pretty slow. Like, isn't rabbit supposed to be, like, super fast or something? God damn it. Also, you can, like, jump all the way up on top of these. Oh, but it's kind of tedious still going this slow but we can get up here oh, it does actually go a little faster when you jump 
like you do get some forward momentum in the air. I can just like go on the side here, can't I? There we go. And let's get the clock key. Let's see if I can beat my time again. I don't think I can though, because some stretches are just so tediously long and we're almost at the end though. Just make sure to get every single every single boost, because you don't wanna don't wanna lose, that's why you get the boost. I didn't get every single one, but still I got it. Didn't get a record time though. That's it for that. Yeah, let's just save so I get the times. Now, let's see. Isn't Yeah, that's the last one. Okay, now we have Jam Dance. I really don't understand this one, to be honest. It's like, it's music, you dance, but I don't really know what. You press around the button and it makes music. And that's it, you just dance. So that's it. There's nothing more of this game to show. We've done everything. Play all the mini games, gotten all the stickers and played all the levels. All levels 100%. That is the first time ever in my silly little life that I've done this. It feels great. But well, I guess that's it for this. See you guys in my next LP. If my Rock Raiders isn't done yet, I have no idea how far in time this is gonna be up. But I don't know, just see you guys later.